Well, as Vladimir Putin doles out intimidation and the consistent threat of war, a natural question is not only what's his strategy, but what is next? For some insight, we turn to News Nation On Balance anchor Leland Vittert. Leland, the world on edge right now. What's Putin's angle at this point? He laid it out pretty clearly this afternoon, Nicole, nighttime in Moscow. He's setting up this situation, if you watch Russian television, where he will claim that there is an oppression or a genocide going on against these Russian ethnic folks in these two breakaway provinces of eastern Ukraine. And these were the same kind of claims that went on in 2014 when I was there. And that's what the Russians used to justify supporting these rebel groups and sending in their equivalents of the Green Berets to help these Russian partisan militias. And you've had this very low-grade conflict going on between the Ukrainians and the Russian militias over the past couple of years. By declaring these areas independent, the Russian president now sets up a situation where he will say, gee, these ethnic Russians are in need of my protection. I, as the president of the Russian people, will go send peacekeepers in to go protect them. The peacekeepers, Russian forces, will then fire on the Ukrainian forces. The Ukrainian forces will fire back. And now we have ourselves a ball game. So the idea that there's going to be one moment where tanks roll and we see an invasion vis-a-vis D-Day not really what's going to happen. You're going to see this slow tick, 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 tick build up until Vladimir Putin bites off as much of Ukraine as he wants. And our reporter in Ukraine was very, was very clear, I thought, what he said is, is that Vladimir Putin made it clear to the world he does not view Ukraine as having a right to exist. That is definitely a line of demarcation. All right, Leland Vitter laying it out there for us. Thank you for that, Leland. You also have more tonight on On Balance at 7, 6 Central. Thank you for watching. Click the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.